According to a Pew Research poll that was released on Monday, most people who are aware of the Bridgegate scandal aren't buying Christie's claims that he was unaware of his aide's involvement when, when the George Washington Bridge was closed. While 58% don't believe the New Jersey Republicans' excuse, 32% do. And as we've all seen by now, when it comes to Governor Christie, when it rains, it pours. Pew also found that Christie's unfavorability ratings have doubled since last year, increasing from 17 to 34%. Uh, John, you know, you always have to take every poll with a grain of salt and people can be very fickle, but how much would you read into this right now? Well, I mean, it's obvious, you know, if you look at those numbers, all the unfavorable came mostly from those who didn't have an opinion uh, in the past. And so, you know, his numbers were just like out of this world um, until this scandal. His numbers are actually still decent. I mean, 38 favorable, 34 unfavorable is better than being upside down, but uh, he's taken a lot of water. There's just no denying that. Um, so, you know, we'll see what happens going forward. It's obviously a, bi it's kind of a partisan split. Most of the uh, unfavorables from Democrats, uh, but he's also, he's also taken some lumps with, uh, with his own party and with conservatives. I saw a story the other day saying that, you know, some people maybe on the far right or the Tea Party were kind of swinging around to defend him now because he was under attack from the press. I don't quite buy into that, but you could see, you know, some of that. But overall, you know, he's uh, he's got to find some way to arrest this momentum. It may just be that news, uh, you know, worldwide, nationally overtakes it at some point.